Today is Friday, January the 13th, 2023. As a quick recap, I have challenged myself to trade my $100,000 options account up to $200,000 using only beginner level option strategies. The two strategies that I'm using are selling cash secured puts and covered calls. In the last video, I took a short position in CZR for expiry today. The underlying did rise in price, so it took the value out of the position, meaning that I could close it out, and that's what I did. So looking here at my activity tab, it shows that I was able to buy to close the short puts for two cents. All right, so now the next question is, what am I going to do next? One possibility is to trade in Dish Networks, which I've had some success in in the past. So if I look here at the Trade tab, just looking at the possibilities that I have here, the one that appeals the most is the 14 strike. It's just at the edge of the expected move here, and it's a 23 delta strike level. I have to ask myself, would I be comfortable getting dish shares put to me at 14? And the answer is yes, I think I would. That is a level that has held up pretty well uh, in the last weeks. I think in the last few weeks, dish got down to 1350, but it quickly rebounded above 14. Of course, the recent rise in the rest of the market had something to do with that. But fundamentally, I don't think there's any problem with being assigned these shares at 14. Of course, there's always the opportunity to manage the position if I change my viewpoint uh, on that going forward. Looking at the position here, I could potentially get a fill at the midpoint between the bid ask spread, which I see is 16 cents. And so I'm inclined to try to put in an order uh, at this level. So Tasty Trade, if I just click on the bid, I can use my buying power to get 88 of these contracts. If I was to do so, at 15 cents, I'd bring in 1320. If I were to get in at 16 cents, I'd bring in 1408. So I have to ask myself, do I want to try to get in at 16 or do I want to try to get in at 15? The risk, of course, of not accepting 15 is that the stock price continues to go up. It's about 30 cents down on the day. So I think here I might just pause the video and wait for a bit just to see what the stock is going to do here in the next few minutes. If the bid price bumps up to 16 cents, I'll get an immediate fill. So I think I'll just wait for that to happen. Okay, so a little bit of patience, I think is going to pay off here. I can pick up the uh, get into the short position at 16 cents instead of 15 cents as the market has moved a few cents against dish and the underlying. All right, so uh, I should get an immediate fill here at 16 cents on my 88 short puts. So I'm going to review and send. Again, love to see this low $10 commission here. So this should bring in about $1,387 into the account. Uh, this all looks good and I'm going to send the order. And I got filled. So if I have to make any adjustments to this position, I'll come back and make an update video. But again, I do feel good about the position fundamentally so that even if I were to get shares put to me at 14, I think that would be okay. Um, and so hopefully Dish Network stays below or rather above 14 by expiration next week.